What if you actually don't need to be as patient as you keep telling yourself that you have to be? And what if you could embrace the time when you are being patient and see it as a beautiful period of unfolding instead of this anxiety-inducing waiting game? Let's talk about it. Hello everyone, it's Gigi and welcome or welcome back to my channel. We talk all about the law of assumption, manifestation, mindset, and spirituality over here. And I'm so glad you've joined us. We're the Journey Fam. Basically, we're just getting absolutely everything we deserve and desire in our lives by being conscious manifestors. We're going to jump right in, but before we do, I want to let you know I do offer one-on-one -on -one coaching, so you will find my email below. You can reach out to me. We'll find a time to work together and get to the bottom of what you're dealing with. Behind the scenes, I have been working on some amazing free tools for you to benefit from. You, my beautiful YouTube subscribers, get first access to all of this when it is announced, so get excited. Now let's get right into the video. This might be a tough pill to swallow. You are not identifying as a version of yourself who already has it. You could actually just decide to have it now. Yes, it is that simple. Let that sink in. You are in a state of yearning. You are in a state of longing. You are not identifying as a version of yourself who already has it. Otherwise, you wouldn't be entertaining these thoughts of, how long do I have to wait? I don't know how much longer I can be this patient. Those would not be thoughts of the version of yourself that already has the thing. You ultimately are the one holding yourself in the energetic pattern of being patient and being in a state of waiting that goes back to radical responsibility, which is what the law of assumption rests upon, that you are taking responsibility for your beliefs. And that is both subconscious and conscious beliefs that are proving true in your reality because what you're believing is true is proving true and showing up in your world. And this is the most magnificent thing that can make you feel so powerful if you use it in the right way. But a lot of times we inadvertently hold ourselves in this waiting game cycle because we think that that's what we have to do because that's the evidence that's showing up. We're seeing things in our world that are telling us, oh, I have to keep being patient. I have to keep waiting. When in reality, we can decide on a moment to moment basis to not be that version of ourselves that has to wait any longer. I know this might sound too good to be true, but really affirm that you are the version of yourself who happily receives absolutely everything in your life that you want in exactly the perfect timing in the right unfolding for you to be able to enjoy it and maintain it and sustain it, whether it's a relationship, a career opportunity, a business victory, any kind of accomplishment, buying a home, graduating from school, you name it. Whatever that is, you can truly speed up the process of receiving it. It's not about trying to become more patient. It's about focusing on embodying the state of the person who already has it. It's just like going to bed on Christmas Eve and knowing when you wake up in the morning that it's going to be Christmas. That doesn't really require a difficult type of patience. It's an excited type of patience that you know it's going to happen. It's inevitable that time will pass and you'll wake up the next morning. You need to start viewing your manifestations that way. I know this was a short and sweet video, but I hope you guys appreciated it. And let me know what you think about this way of looking at patience. And let me know if you think it's really necessary. I also will link my video above on persistence. I think that we decide whether or not we need to be patient or whether or not we are ready, willing, and able to embody the version of ourselves that already has it. Very excited to hear your thoughts. Talk to you later.